Welcome everyone to another wonderful episode here at Jaws Podiatry. We find ourselves once again in our office based surgical suite. We have just finished a toe shortening transformation. Uh, the patient, I asked the patient if it was okay to do what I like to call the, the testimonial vlog. Um, and she agreed, so I want to start off by saying thank you. Um, and she was also very generous to show her, her face on camera, which is, not a lot of people will do that. So, tell us a little bit about your story in respect to the long toes. So, um, I've had insecurities for a long time uh, with my feet. Uh, I was made fun of at a very young age, um, usually it started around 10 or 11 with some family members, and I always hid my toes um, from my family members, from my parents, from my now husband uh, for a couple of years actually when we started, um, and always wore socks and shoes, never any open toe um, footwear. And I really just, it really affected me. And it was probably my main and biggest insecurity with myself. And then what happened? Um, I actually found you on YouTube and on Instagram. And I saw your work and I was amazed with everything you did and how you presented everything with no, no pins and no screws and everything and I liked how the process was and I called you, well, the doctor's office and um, from the beginning to the end, from the booking, from talking to everybody here, it's been a pleasure from the surgery to now, it's been amazing. You guys have been amazing and the process has been life-changing. So, you know, I, I, I usually have a, a lot to say. I guess you have summed it up, you know, and packaged, you know, packaged everything for the world to sort of hear. Um, you know, this is not something that people talk over dinner, right? Take a look at my long toes. Um, but the truth of the matter is that these are, you know, when we talk about, you know, toe shortening transformations, you know, the definition of a transformation really goes, you know, a long way. This is, this is a real transformation. And this is not something that, that, that germinates into the transformation. This is something that, you know, that you see it now, right, before, and then there's the after. And it's very, very, um, very shocking in a good way, right? Because something has been a certain way for such a long time and the emotional factors have been sort of trailing mm -hmm. for such a long time that when you see the change, it's just like, you know, wow. It is. Um, you know, again, local anesthesia, patient is awake, just like the patient said, no screws, pins, or plates. Mm -hmm. Um, but I'm very happy that you're happy. I'm excited to see the results. Exactly. So the recovery process starts as we speak. You know, I'd like to, is there anything else that you want to say? Okay, great. Um, as always, I'd like to take this opportunity to thank, obviously, the patient for doing this, uh, you know, vlog, testimonial vlog. I think it really, really helps people out there. They can hear it from me, that's okay, but when they hear it from you, the patient, 
totally different element. Yeah, it's been an amazing process entirely. And even during the process of the actual procedure, I didn't feel a thing. So I was a little worried about Me that. Me neither, by the way. <laughs> but it was amazing, and you guys have been amazing to me, and the entire process was incredible. Excellent. Well, we're really glad to hear. I'd like to take this opportunity, as always, to thank the entire team here at Jobs Podiatry. Uh, Liz that just walked out. Uh, Caesar is, uh, who, you know, who knows where. He's the, sort of like the man of mystery, right? And then uh, Dr. Nunez is always uh, who, who helped in this incredible transformation. So, um, you know, we will continue to do what, what we do. We will continue to educate the world that these surgical techniques, right? Minimally invasive uh, foot and ankle surgery or surgical techniques to exist. And you know, whether this is, again, whether it's something functional or something aesthetic, we can correct these deformities using the minimally invasive techniques. So I wish there was someone here to help us close the segment as we always do. Oh, there's Liz Ben. So perfect. Uh, so we will continue to do what we do. We will continue to educate the world, one foot, one toe, and one shortened toe, or one short toe at a time. Lisbeth, is there anything else that you want to add? Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching. That's, that's deep. That's deep. Yeah, no, you're right. Thank you. Thank you for watching, everyone. Have a wonderful weekend, everyone.